Uh, good morning. Uh, my name is Virendra Sethi. I am a professor here at IIT Bombay. Um, I want to welcome you to this uh, exciting course on college to corporate, uh, where we will be uh, looking at two, three different domains. Uh, professor Fatak will be here in a little bit, who will give you a little more introduction to the overall course. I am sure you have had a chance to look at the introductory videos, uh, one by Professor Fatak, one by Professor Parthasarthi, and one by me. Uh, there are many uh, participants. Uh, the last number I have is 2500 plus, uh, and it is being offered through two uh, modes. One is through the AVU mode, where you would be at a remote center, and we get a chance to interact live. Uh, and the other mode is through uh, live stream on YouTube, uh, where uh, you would be listening to me. But if you have uh, any responses, you would put them on the discussion forum. And we have a team that will be monitoring your questions. And those will get communicated to me or whoever is you know, on, the, on the screen at that time. And uh, we will try our best to answer most of your questions. Uh, if not, uh, there are some major concerns or major questions, then we will just consolidate them and have and respond to them through uh, the IIT Bombay X. Um, so, um, uh, I would like to maybe begin with the PowerPoint presentation that I have prepared for you. Uh, this is intended to be informal. A lot of work that you would be doing uh, would be through the watching of videos and through the quizzes that are associated with the videos. Uh, I'm sure you've heard of uh, this. Uh, not now, not so new, but uh, still, you know, quite new. Uh, the flipped class mode, class mode, in which uh, a student is is expected to finish up the reading and the preparation, and they come for the class, not for the lecture, uh, but they come more for asking questions and um, getting things addressed which they could not uh, understand from the book or from the notes. Uh, so, the uh, classroom therefore becomes a session for interaction. So, I could easily record this as a video and you will be able to see it, uh, but this face to face is really an opportunity for us to talk to each other. Okay? So, I want to welcome you to this mode and uh, feel free. Uh, you must know that while I have uh, gray hair and I have a title of professor against my name, uh, at some time in my life, I was in the same place where you are, uh, and there were people uh, who actually mentored me, and who coached me, and who trained me, and it's my pleasure uh, to be that someone for you, along with our entire team. Um, so, um, I'm going to be the person who's going to be accountable for the soft skills part. Professor Partha Sarthi is uh, coordinating the workplace communication, and of course, Professor Fatak is uh, looking at an overview of the entire program. Um, so, with that, I will, I'd like to go to uh, my PowerPoint uh, slides. Uh, so, if you could please switch over to PowerPoint. Thank you. Okay. So, um, I, I, I'm sure everybody knows by now because you've registered. You have some background on it. Uh, we have been offering the C2C, which is the college to corporate, and this is the autumn 2018 offering. Uh, the first part of the uh, course is the soft skills and workplace communication, and what I'm doing now now is giving you an introduction, and Professor Fatak will be joining in a little bit too. Um, next slide, please. Okay, so um, I don't know what else to say to welcome you. Um, I, I'm, 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 I'm just hope you're experiencing being welcome. But I want to welcome you to something and thank you for something. Okay, um, welcome to this domain of growth and development. And I want to thank you on behalf of all of us here uh, for being the kind of person who is committed to one's own growth and development. Okay. Um, the, the, the closest example that I can think of right now is um, that you are committed to being a great player. 
and uh, it takes something to say I am I'm, 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 I'm going to do whatever it takes to be a great player and uh, when the body is tired and you have to get up in the morning and go for a jog and do the workout and do the practice, uh, it's usually uh, that is where the question of your commitment comes in. Sitting in front of a TV with a remote control, you don't need, you know, don't need that. But if you get committed to climbing Mount Everest and you know it is going to take several months and several years of practice and training to be able to do that with no guarantee that you will actually be successful. Okay, uh, it is uh, that's that's the kind of you know person that I'm in the experience of you being. So thank you for being that kind of a person. Uh, I'd like for you to also uh, stand in the place of honor and respect, and honor and respect is for yourself uh, as well as peers uh, for taking this initiative. You know, so while we are offering it from here, uh, I just want you to know that over a period of next few weeks, you will realize that the people sitting next to you are also the kind of people who are committed to their growth and development. Okay? So when there are people around you like that, when you are surrounded with people who are up for greatness and for up for you know, having, being champions, uh, you begin to have a whole. So I want to stand in the place of honoring you, respecting you and the people around you uh, who will be actually uh, the players and who will actually be the people who will help you do the practice and move on and go to the next level of your growth and development. Okay, so I want to welcome you to that. So this is broadly the schedule for uh, the face to face sessions. The dates are today which is the first face to face session. Uh, next one is in October again a Saturday. These are all Saturdays. The timing are the same 9.30 a.m. to 1 p.m. with a half an hour break in between. Uh, the next session is on October 3rd, following that 13th October, following that 27th October. The first two sessions face to face are intended for soft skills and the next two sessions are intended for workplace communications. Now, I just want you to know that sometimes it is difficult to be able to say which is soft skills and which is workplace. So you do not worry about that. I think what you need to do is just make sure that you are attending the face to face sessions doing the work which is required from the watching of videos and from the uh, work on the quiz and some additional work that might be required and just you know you just want to play along keep doing the work practice 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 and it will all show up at the end of these four weeks. Uh, there are other components like uh, IT for example uh, for which details would be available to you from the IIT Bombay X interface independently. So I am going to focus only on the soft skills and the workplace uh, communications component. For today, uh, there are four parts, uh, each session, each lecture so to say. I do not want to call it a lecture because I would like for it to be more of an interactive uh, session. Uh, but all the same, the, the, the first part which is now that is happening is the introduction to soft skills uh, followed by. Um, Dr. Lina Jha who will be covering aspects of verbal and non-verbal communication both written and oral and conducting and participating in meetings. So that is what she would focus on. After that Professor Sundar will deal with reading and writing skills and then I will come back at 12.15 to talk to you about getting committed to your growth and development. Okay? It is we will talk more about that. I am tempted to already start talking about that but I will talk about that in a little bit when I come at 12.15. Okay, so uh, uh, before I move on with this preparatory work, I'd just like to maybe interact uh, with a few of you at your centers uh, to get a sense of who's there and uh, what's the commitment that you have in this uh, conversation. So we are now uh, going live on AView. Okay, where is that? Patna? Noida. Where? Uttar Pradesh. Uttar Pradesh, Noida. Is it Noida? Dronacharya College, good morning. Can you hear me, Dronacharya?
Okay, so I request all all the centers uh, to please be ready with the microphones and the uh, video cameras so that uh, we can quickly move from one center to another. Okay, so where are we now? Yes, National College of Engineering. Where is that? Tamil Nadu. Tamil Nadu. Okay, National College of Engineering. Can you hear me? Good morning. Can you hear me? Please wave your hand if you can hear me. All right, let's maybe move on to the next one. MGM College, hello. Yeah, good morning, sir. Good morning, good to see you. Uh, okay, everybody's waving out. Hello, everybody. Hey, good morning. All right, very this is good. Prasad, the course coordinator of college. Okay, yeah, thank you very much for program. organizing it. I appreciate your partnership. Thank you very much. And I'd, well, here's what I'd like to do. What I'd like to do is I'd like to hear uh, from some of the participants as to what is it that they're committed to getting out of this course. So, would somebody like to please share? Yes, among the students, yes. Yeah. Somebody would like to talk? Yes, yeah. You can come forward. Yeah. Come forward, yeah. Thank you. Yes, uh, so I will, uh, whatever you will offer, I will try to get, get it the best and I will try to implement in our uh, day to day activities, day to day um, all the programs and uh, also in the future. That's e it. Yeah, excellent. So, what's your name? My name is Tanmay Misar. Hello, Tanmay. How I'm, are you? Uh, from second year, seven. Second year Fine civil sir. engineering. Okay, very nice. It's, yeah, you, I'm happy you're starting on this early. Second year civil engineering is good time. So the next two three years, then uh, you get a chance to practice some of these while you're still in college. So that's fabulous. Okay. So um, here's uh, something. Yes, and so Tanmay, Tanmay, right? Yes, sir. Okay. So Tanmay, uh, first of all, thank you for being the first one to raise your hand and coming in front and having this conversation. So I want to thank you for that and give you a big clap. Thank you, sir. Yeah. Thank you. All right. No, no, no. I still um, want to talk to him. I still want to talk to him. Tanmay, come back. Okay. Yes, sir. All right. So Tanmay, for the next half an hour, uh, you and I are going to talk, okay? Yes, sir. <laughs> are you okay with that? Yes, I am okay with that. All right, I'm excellent. Happy so, no, no, no. So, keep keep the microphone. Don't yeah, don't give the microphone yet. I need to talk to you. So, you are representing for me the entire 2,500 people across the country right now. Okay, okay sir. Okay. So, thank you. Yeah. So, I'm 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 going to uh, request you uh, to share your aspirations. Uh, from this course such that then uh, other people also get to hear you know themselves in what you're saying and I'll give other people a chance too uh, but I really because you're the first one here I'd like to hear from you uh, if the soft skills course if the workplace communication course if whatever is available okay if it was available to you right now how would your life change So actually, uh, if soft skills are the most important thing nowadays because uh, everyone has the knowledge, but no one has the knowledge, uh, no one has the skills to uh, show their knowledge. So if I would have got a chance earlier, so I would definitely have made some use of it, and also I would have gained some experience. The thing is that I don't have the current experience to use the soft skills, but I'm planning to use the soft skills. So that's why I took this course. Okay. So, you know, you have, you already have great soft skills? Yes, sir. You know that? I am I will not sure, I am not sure I have great, but I have, well, means it is a so-so. I want to make it great. Uh, okay, very good. So, I am, I am saying that you already have great soft skills. Thank you, sir. <laughs> so, you, you should know that I am a very uh, uh, funny kind of a person. Uh, anytime I give an yes. acknowledgement, 
I also add after that a responsibility. <laughs> so is that okay? Actually, I'm not habitual of that. So I, 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 I got it. I got it. Okay. So I just want to invite you to this new paradigm where you are not someone who needs anything, but you are someone who is getting trained to be a champion. Yes, sir. Nobody needs this course. Well, Only people who are up for championships. Only people who are up for actually having like a great career, having a great life, being of service. Those are the kinds of people who will commit to this kind of a work over weekends and work during the week, even though your own courses are going on. So this is extra work. This means less sleep. You get that? Yes, sir. Yeah. But I totally yeah. understand. Yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. So I'm not, you know, I'm not here to, um, I don't have any magic stick. I, I wish I had, but I don't have a magic stick which I can just wave and say, okay, Tanmay, from here onwards, you have all the skills that are required. <laughs> okay? That would so, have been great, sir. Yeah, so very good. So I, I, I thank you for being someone. Uh, who is up for this and who will do the work and uh, I'll only give you some you know some tips some hints some push some direction uh, but ultimately it's you who's going to actually make it happen and uh, if you uh, you know break through certain things that you have not had a chance to break through because you didn't get an opportunity to practice in the past and now you break through because you got a chance to practice who do you think will be the happiest person? Actually, the happiest person will be all my teachers, my parents, and mm, the most I don't know about that. Be. I don't know about yes. that. I will be happy. <laughs> yes, sir. Obviously, we'll be happy. <laughs> so, <laughs> because yeah. I'm a student, so yeah, excellent, excellent. And so by by the way, I just want to also uh, point to the fact that did you did you see, when I say who would be the happiest? Um, I was joking a little bit about me, of course I'll be happy, but immediately who came to you were your teachers, your parents, your friends. Yes, sir. Yeah? Yes, sir, because um, in the end, uh, the friends, the family, teachers are always with us. They will always guide, to, uh, guide us and um, whenever I will take a step, they will also guide us. So, so the most important thing is they are there, so I am there. So I will always uh, listen to them. So hey, you know, you, 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 you got it all sorted out already, so I am so happy that you got it all sorted out. Uh, and uh, you know, so your source relationships, your relationship with your friends, your teachers, your parents are well acknowledged and well accepted and that's already a huge step forward, okay? That's really a big deal. Yes, I just want you to know it's a big deal if you already got that handled. Yes, sir. Okay. So now I'm going to have yes, a different conversation with you and the conversation okay. is this, okay? So anything you want to say about what I just said? So no sir, I was uh, actually I thought it was of, up to the point and also I uh, means I was understandable on, uh, sorry, I actually believe that you are right and uh, that's also. Okay, excellent. We'll wait. Excellent. So, um, Okay, I can see a lot of people. Uh, can you please have the camera be back on Tanmay because I want to see him. <laughs> yes, sir. All right, good, excellent. All right, so uh, by the way, uh, everybody else there, hello, okay. I just want to, so please feel included. As I'm having this conversation with Tanmay, please make sure that you are included, okay. I'm including you. It just happens that I cannot talk to each one of you. So therefore, this conversation with Tanmay is uh, something I'm using to reach, reach across to you. So. Tanmay, the next conversation I want to have with you is uh, a little uh, more complicated. Okay. Are you ready? Yes sir. yes, sir. Bring it on. Okay, very good. So, I just want you to know that you are now entering adulthood. So, sorry, pardon, sir? You are now entering adulthood. Ah, yes, sir. You were till now... A, a child, a boy, a teenager, but you're close to now entering adulthood. Yes, sir. So everything that you had expected adults to do, 
you will be now expected to do yes sir okay so when you say yes, growth sir. growth and development uh, it is a different paradigm now yes sir so in some sense you would be now partners with your teachers and parents also yes sir now you do yes, not sir. have a relationship with corporate yet or with the profession yet yes sir so there is no teacher there is no parent in the company um uh, yes sir okay Most, yes. yeah so you are being expected now to be a grown up adult and a partner yes sir and it's not that your training will stop your training will continue you will always learn from your seniors not a problem but you will not be related to as a son or as a student yes sir and sometimes not even as a friend yes sir maybe because, <laughs> maybe in future yeah yeah because you are expected now to be a partner fully responsible for your accountability yes okay that's a professional life yes sir okay very good so now that's the kind of work in which all the different modules will begin to plug in okay yes all right okay so uh, yes, yeah so i'm going to now do a little bit of thinking work so that everybody can get included uh, so tanmay i want to thank you and some other time when we are up for this face to face uh, you're welcome to come up again and talk some more okay yes sir you will see me around sir okay good thank you very awesome. much give him a big hand please everybody thank you, thank you. yeah thank you, thank you all right tanmay bye bye next please let's go to another place we can go back there also because there's several people there jspm all right jspm college pune jspm college yes sir all right all right good very good yeah that's a way good way of saying hello yeah so i visually i can see you so somebody is on the microphone who i cannot see so if you could just move a little more towards the aisle in the middle all right good morning very good morning sir what's your name um, my name is bidisha sharma sir say that again from second year i am bidisha sharma bidisha sir. okay bidisha I'm very nice second year com- computer okay, sec- engineering which engineering computer engineering computer sir. engineering second all right year. very good i'm so happy you know some of you in the second year are actually participating in this course we had originally intended for it to be people in their 6th uh, semester 7th semester but you're right it's probably already too late this is the right time to be doing it okay so what are your aspirations what do you want to learn from this uh, entire course um so firstly uh, as the previous uh, students said of the um, nanded college uh, the same thing we ha- we can acquire knowledge easily um knowledge can be acquired easily but the main problem is communication sir even if you know how the things work how uh, coding works the main problem is how we connect with the people for example if i am going to uh, if i am if i am acquiring a job and if i don't know how to communicate with people i'll not be able to share my knowledge so according to me i think communication comes first before knowledge okay excellent so, so that, it's a, it's a little strange for me you communicate so well uh <laughs> that's uh this uh, professional com- communication and this communication is a is a bit different for me i guess so, but how is it different uh, i think this is of- this is very professional i don't see any problem with this uh, but still according to me i'm not that satisfied of my communication skills and provided that you have college to corporate program you so, are providing such beautiful lectures and guidance for soft skills so why not we I I yeah. Be, yeah I'm not why too sh- I'm not too sure about beautiful I'm sure at some point in time you will not see the beauty on it because it's only going to be hard work Exactly okay. but uh, <laughs> within that there is beauty inside that hard work I so appreciate I appreciate your very privilege Very nice I appreciate your viewpoint fabulous So if you got all the skills that you yes, are sir. aspiring for what would life look like so firstly uh i would like to increase my confidence now 
even if, if even if i'm standing here in front of everyone i'm still shaking a bit so <laughs> so after acquiring such knowledge and soft skills i think i'll be quite confident about myself i'll be confident of my knowledge i'll be confident uh, with my personality so i think because of this i'll be taking this course excellent excellent so are you a human being Pardon? Yes, sir. Definitely. I asked. No, that's the question I asked. Actually, yeah. Are you a human being? I, th I guess so. Yes, sir. Are you guessing? Ask people around you. Hey, people around, tell me if she's a human being. I am a human being. Sir. Excellent, excellent. So human beings uh, do shake when they pick up a microphone. Yes, sir. But uh, uh, great orators do not, sir. How do you know? So, Did you ask anyone? Ask me. After so many years. as i'm sitting over here talking to you my legs legs are still shaking <laughs> uh, still sir the voice trembling and um, it won't go away yeah. it's still i'll i'll be a little bit more confident and yeah so you will myself. yeah very good so i think the concern is that that comes in the way of your commitment right now yes sir okay so uh yes. when you first started walking you don't remember right exactly sir yeah you won't remember but if you ask your parents when you first started walking did you fall or did you not fall uh sir i remember i was i started walking late because i was very inconfident as i already <laughs> mentioned <laughs> so soft skills should have come in then right <laughs> Okay, I'm yeah, listening. Actually, so I started walking late. No problem. But you, did you fall a few times? Obviously, sir. It is okay, right, to did fall. You? Yes, sir. Definitely. Did you did you say at that time to yourself, no, 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 I should not fall. Mother gravity, why are you doing this to me? I should be more confident. I should not shake. I should be able to walk without any problems. Did you have that kind of a conversation with God or with Mother Earth? I don't think so sir. No, and you didn't, right? <laughs> okay, good. So I just like for you to it's okay to have this conf, conf, uh, the conversation about your legs shaking or you not having enough confidence, but I just want you to know that the more you actually going the more you going to actually engage in that conversation, it is not going to let you actually do what is required. Yes sir. So my request to you is to just honor your experience. that you have of your shaky or your voice trembling that's part of human allow it it's okay yes sir and now you want to start doing the work that is required so that you can fulfill on your commitment yes sir so i'd like for you to begin to tell me what is your commitment uh so commitment um I would like to increase my yes communication comes first and also I would like to increase my vocabulary my grammar or everything that is required for soft skills everything that is required for interaction suppose, with my fellow suppose suppose all of suppose all of that is already handled what is your commitment so I'll uh, I'll definitely work hard and um, try to please everyone with my dedication and sincerity sir excellent and soft skills with soft skills will definitely help sir excellent so which came first the chicken or the egg <laughs> sir the chicken um, egg i guess egg then comes the chicken i don't know <laughs> so it's always going to be a paradox are you going to wait for soft skills to develop and then do that or once you start doing that the soft skills begin to develop sir soft skills will be an accelerator it will be it will act as a catalyst sir for um, doing professionalism uh, only knowledge is as i told before sir only knowledge is not sufficient that catalyst that accelerator is required which is soft skills which we all want to acquire so that we can we will be able to communicate will be able to share our knowledge with everyone sir so let me ask you slightly differently do you know how to ride a bicycle yes sir okay excellent So what accelerated your learning of the bicycle soft skills uh, No sir that's completely practice Ah Practicing how to pedal uh, for Excellent. pedaling then And you fell down a few times didn't you 
Exactly. Yeah. So can can I invite you to something? Just try on something. You have been doing it a particular way till now. Can I coach you? Can I be your coach here? Yes, sir. Okay. So my coaching is to start doing the things that you're committed to. Soft skills will emerge. Okay, sir. So get onto yes, the bicycle. Sure, sir. So the question then I'm really asking is, what is the see? What is it's a very funny situation. What happens is we are waiting to be ready some day, one day, but we don't know for what. Exactly, sir. So I'm future going. Future is unpredictable. Huh? Sorry. Future is unpredictable, sir. We don't know what is going to happen next. But who gets to say what is going to be? True, sir. So my invitation then is. to start looking at if all of this were available if ma saraswati came at night and waved a magic wand on you and said hey you got everything that you need the only thing that you really need to tell me is what is it that you are going to now commit your life to sir i would like to commit my work um, commit myself into work my aims and my aspirations my parents dream i would like to fulfill all that and what is that Putting, dream so to do something in computer engineering uh, as we know today in this uh, world full of technology people are still searching for better and efficient techniques so i i guess with my knowledge if i can help the fellow people of my fellow country or my fellow mates by doing anything by discovering or by doing anything that is uh, more useful for our society or contribute something which will be a uh, which will contribute to the betterment of the society okay so, fabulous fabulous yeah. now i just like to get a show of hands in the room to say how many people have similar aspirations it may not be in computer science but it could be different areas so how many people have aspirations like that All right, look around. Look around. Excellent, excellent. So here's the. Can I now give you some homework? Yes, sir. Okay. Talk to at least three people in a day. Yes, sir. About your aspiration, about your dream. Yes, sir. And ask them what you should do. Okay, sir. You you promise to do that? Sure, sir. Okay. Now that's not just for you, okay? It's for everybody in your room. So, if everybody is taking on that promise, please stand up. <laughs> all right. Big hand for all of you, okay? Thank you very much. Thank you. Please sit down. Please sit down. Thank you. Yes, sir. Yeah. So while I'm interacting with uh, JSPM in Pune, right? Yeah. Uh, yes, this sir. this interaction is expected. I'm I'm requesting that everybody else on uh, the A view or on the YouTube that you please take on that that which you are committed to, that which you dream, begin today. Talk to at least three people today, tomorrow, day after tomorrow, every day for the next two weeks, and begin to listen to what they have to say to you. Listen, listen carefully as to what this. Ask what is needed. talk to experts talk to senior people don't talk to each other because you know you 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 with each other are going to be same level so you may not be able to grow out of that okay talk to senior people talk to experts who will then be able to guide you mentor you be a demand for mentorship be a demand for apprenticeship ask for support can you do that yes sir excellent so i want to thank you for this interaction and i welcome you to this world of practice Thank you sir. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Thank yeah. You, bye bye. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, give a big hand to her please. Thank you. All right. Um let's go to the next center. Otherwise I can go to the slides now because I have some slides to cover. Okay. So, um I'm now going to uh, is this full screen can we do full screen yeah so uh, I'm now going to suggest some work 
which is not just for a particular lecture, but it is it's, it's work that is required for you to be warmed up to receive the inputs that are going to come from here. Okay, so, for, for example, any time that you go for a workout, uh, any time you go for exercising, it is recommended that you do a warm up. Okay, it is good for the, 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 the blood circulation, the, you know, the warm up of the body, all of that is required before you get into an intense exercise uh, phase. So, I am going to offer you some activities here, uh, which I suggest that you do between now and the next week. Uh, and some of the things, some of the inputs, some of the videos are going to begin to play up very differently uh, the moment you begin to do this preparatory work. So, let me just go over this. First activity is write up in 100 words or so, take a notebook, keep an exclusive notebook for this. Okay? For the course, college to corporate, keep an exclusive notebook. Okay? Do your own work. Nobody is going to see this, nobody is going to grade it, but you will be able to see it two, two weeks from now, one month from now, a year from now and look back and see you know, what is the growth and development that you have caused for yourself. Okay? So, here is some of the preparatory suggested work, write up to, up to, not more, do not write too much, you know, because there are many questions here, up to 100 words in response to the following questions. What according to you are soft skills? What do you call hard skills? What do you call soft skills? Okay, most of you have said, while I have knowledge, I do not have soft skills, but maybe good idea to do a little more detailing. If you want to go to the web, go to the web type up softwares on Google, see what shows up. Okay? So, it, just, just, just distinguish as to what are the different elements of soft skills and maybe then all the courses, maybe all the uh, lectures, maybe then all the videos will begin to show different aspects of what soft skills could be. Okay? I am not saying that we are covering everything that needs to be covered in soft skills. You know, maybe in such a short time we cannot do that. However, they do point you in a direction and then you can take them. But the first thing that you need to do is ask the question, inquire into the question, what according to you are soft skills? Okay? Then they could also be, okay, I list 10 soft skills and then say, okay, of these 10, these 7 I think I am okay, I am good at, but these 3 I need to practice. I want to get trained for these 3. The next question is, why are they important to you? I, again, you know, sometimes you, what I have he heard from the two interactions I have had is that, you know, you would be able to serve better, you would be able to do things that you want to do, you will be able to do them better. Yeah, sure. Uh, and uh, uh, so, the, the why it is important for you is totally and completely connected with what is important for you and what are you committing to. Okay? So, it is that this particular question is expected you to in some way write a statement of purpose. What is your purpose? And it does not have to be a lifetime purpose. It could be a purpose for the next six months. It could be a purpose for the you know graduation. It could be purpose for getting a you know a good body. It could be a purpose for you know eating right. It could be a purpose of you know participating in the community. Okay. So, what is important to you? Only you get to say. What is your bicycle? You get to say. I'm here to be able to tell you to get onto the bicycle maybe hold you a little bit on the bicycle at the back and push you and be there when you fall down so that we can put you back on the bicycle till you practice and practice and practice and then I am not needed and your soft skills are needed, not needed. You ride the bicycle because now you have access to riding the bicycle. You do not have a concern about uh, having the skills to ride a bicycle. You now ride the bicycle and then there will be the new bicycle and then the new bicycle and the new bicycle. Okay? So, each time you expand your growth you expand your development, you expand your game, new skills will be required and you will be up for getting trained. The last question there is, well, if you know that these are the skills that are required, how are you going to achieve them? How are you going to acquire these skills? Okay? And this course probably is a starting point for you. You are committed to this course, so clearly you know that you will need support, you will need coaching and you are up for it. So, I thank you for that, for being, you know, for honoring your, your commitment and this is only a limited exposure. People around you, your friends, your teachers, your parents, they are the real coaches who are sitting right around you, 
who will be on a day to day in a live online real time basis be able to tell you what is needed and wanted. You have got to be the kind of person who can listen and turn it into you something useful. I'll give you an example. Uh, I met, I am sure everybody has heard of Martina Navratilova. Uh, she is a great uh, tennis player. In fact, she recently was in the news because of some uh, uh, unpleasant event that happened on one of the tennis courts. And so she came on the news at some point in time. So I happen to know uh, somebody who is to coach uh, Navratilova. Okay? So I asked the coach, I never met Navratilova, I just met the coach. So I asked the coach, I said, what is it that makes her so great? And uh, so she thought for a moment and then she said, whatever coaching I give to her, to, Na to Martina, whatever coaching I give to her, whatever I say to her, she turns it into gold. Okay? So that is the mark of a great player, that is the mark of a champion, where whatever you hear from your friends, whatever you hear from your parents, whatever you hear from your teachers, you take that and turn that into gold. Okay? So that is what I am inviting you to. Be the champion. Next slide, I will just go over some more questions. This is activity 2, not very different, maybe a little more elaborate. The questions are, what do you wish to learn from this course? In what ways do you think this course will change you as a person? How does this course fit in with your career goals and aspirations? Which topic do you think will most help you achieve your dream job? You know, so the entire schedule is there and you may look at, look to see, okay, this might be important for me, this might be important for me. That does not mean others are not important. I can bet you that things that you think you already know, there is more, there is a deeper level to go to. So, while you are, you can be focused on a few things, not everything, but at the same time others are equally important and it is like one hand can't operate without the body and the other hand can't operate without the body, you know the whole there is a certain, uh, there is a certain design to the system. Each one of these elements will play in, okay? but still you can focus on saying, okay, today I am going to strengthen my upper body and a week from now I will strengthen my legs. Okay? You can do that. Uh, how do you, how do you, okay, how do you, <laughs> this, is a, uh, this is an important question here okay? and I am going to spend a little bit of time on this. How do you plan to create the time required for this course? Okay. Uh, I was going to say this in the next lecture, but let me share it with you now. Um, you know, in end of December, around 15th of December to 31st of December, the enrollment in gym is highest. Everybody is making a New Year's resolution that they will join the gym and they will have a great body. Okay. So, most of the gyms hire extra people but they only hire them for three weeks of January. Why? Because by the time the third week of January comes, most people have already dropped out. The, one, the New Year's resolution has gone out of the window and people are back, there is no time anymore. The people are busy, right? US students are very busy, everybody is busy. So the question very consciously is, how are you going to create time that is required for this course? You want to get out a calendar, I will talk about this again in the next, maybe next face to face. You want to get out a calendar, weekly calendar. I suggest you start from Saturday, not from Monday. Saturday, Sunday, so last day is Friday. Most of your planning and most of the preparation work gets done on Saturday, Sunday, so that the next five days are free. Then you attend classes, have a, you know, study, do homework, etc. But you freed up, you are actually having you, because the preparation got done on Saturday, Sunday, you are you know, all, you're all re ready to play now. And you create a calendar with a half an hour resolution and today, I, I recommend that today sit down, look at the entire schedule of this uh, co college to corporate program and create a calendar in which you will say, okay, this is the time that I am going to spend on this, this is the time I am going to do practice sessions, this is the time uh, as we just spoke in the previous two interaction that you will go and talk to three people every day to say what is it that you aspire for and what is it that you committed for. Okay? It will take time. It could also be during lunch hour, it could also be during evening tea time hour. It's, it will, so you want to eliminate all the chit chats, you want to eliminate all the gossip because you have no idea how much time goes into chit chats and how much time goes into gossips. Players, great players, champions do not have time for that. 
See if you can cut down on your TV time. I'm not saying don't listen to the TV. I love watching TV, okay? I love watching movies. But at the same time, you must know that a, 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 if, you, you know, if you're up on a path of being a champion, you will have to cut down on some things which are not necessarily forwarding what you're committed for, okay? So you'll have to create the time to be able to fulfill on what's required in terms of practice and work for this course. Okay, so that's probably what I said. Pro pro present a we weekly plan on the activities and time that you will allocate to this. So who do you present it to? It may be a good idea to get a friend who's already in the course or even to your parents or even to your teachers to say this is what I'm promising, this is my weekly schedule and I'm going to keep this and make that promise. And if you break that promise, clean it up. Just say, hey, I didn't keep my promise, but now I'm keeping my promise and get onto the bicycle again and start the practice, okay? So if you fall down from the bicycle, don't blame gravity and don't say circumstances are such and I've got so much to do that I cannot really do this work, I shouldn't have registered for it, blah, 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 blah. Don't do that. Champions don't do that. Champions fall down, get hurt, get up again, start playing. That doesn't mean you don't rest. The greatest of champions and greatest of players rest. They take rest. You must take rest. But at the same time, for every waking minute, you're a champion, you're a champion, and you're a champion. So be it. Okay? All right. Very good. Uh, I think I may be short on time now. I actually have exceeded time. So I will bring this next two, three slides when I see you at 12.15. I'll bring up these slides. So can I uh, quickly see uh, a few faces so I can say bye-bye and then we can start the next session. My apologies, uh, Dr. Lena. I uh, am two minutes overboard. All right, where are we? MES Pillai. MES Pillai Institute, how are you? All right, very good. So will one person please take the microphone? Okay, thank you very much for taking the microphone. What's your name? Okay, I cannot hear you. Microphone, just make sure it's on. Good morning, sir. Hi, good morning. Neha. What's your name? Neha Patel. Okay, Neha. So, what is it that you're hearing? I just want a quick uh, update to hear what is it that you're hearing and then I'll hand it over to Dr. Lena Jha for the next uh, lecture. So, please go ahead. Tell me how is it going? What are you hearing? Is it useful for you? Yes, it is useful for me. Uh, I would like to uh, like improve my Hold the microphone close to your mouth. Yeah. Yeah, this course is helpful for me. Like I enrolled for this course because uh, I want to improve my uh, communication skills along with soft skills and all. And this will be uh, useful for my future days if I enter into corporate world and after. Excellent. So I have the, the specific question I have is for the last, you know, 45 minutes or so, You've been listening. I just want to know, tell, tell me one thing that you really learnt out of listening in this last 45 minutes. It's okay. You, you may not be able to recall, but just tell me, did you learn something or did you not? <laughs> yes, I learned something. Okay, very good. So, when I, when I come at 12.15, I will ask you, so by that time, make sure that you, have, you can tell me two things that you have learned. Is that okay? Okay, so while I am saying that to Neha, 
that's uh, that's applicable to everybody please okay i can call up any particular center and request you to give me feedback is that okay okay good okay very good thank you very much i'll see you again at 12:15 i'm going to invite uh, welcome uh, dr lena jha who will now take the next session okay so please welcome dr lena jha okay and neha thank you very much okay bye bye